Brendan Mortensen here from the PNC Digital Desk, PNC Bank, helping to make a difference. The Orioles drop a close one today. Here's Brandon Hyde after the loss. So I threw the ball really well. Um, thought the command has improved. Thought the stuff was excellent. Just had a tough time there in the sixth. But besides that, he was uh, played through the ball really, really well. I'm really excited about him. What was going on with Baker tonight? Well, he was throwing the ball well, and then he lost Hayward, and then just made an 0-2 mistake to Taylor there with the lead. Has it been kind of a, I don't know, common theme for Grayson that he has that one inning where maybe things don't go exactly according to plan? Like well, this is a tough lineup to get through three times, and that's that's a tough top of the order, and and um, you know he left with a we were up four one when he left. Was there a thought um, they might pull him after two? To the Dodger lineup at all? Or I'm sorry. Was there any was there any consideration given to you know he'd been through the lineup twice and just with the state of our bullpen, I thought he was still throwing the ball well and you know he gave up that hard hit to Betts be, the, the inning before, but um, but I still had more left in the tank and so we just we couldn't you know we didn't, we didn't pitch our best there in the sixth inning. What kind of challenges does their bullpen present? Well, it's a lot of elo. If Stuff guys, a lot of a lot of guys with big stuff, and and uh, we, you know that's another thing. I mean, we had four innings to try to catch up, and we didn't score against the bullpen. Brendan Mortensen here from the PNC Digital Desk, PNC Bank, helping to make a difference. The Orioles drop a close one today. Here's Brandon Hyde after the loss.